أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم The hour of judgment is nigh and the moon is cleft asunder but if they see a sign they turn away and say this is but transient magic they reject the warning and follow their own lusts but every matter has its appointed time they have already come to them recitals wherein there is enough to check them mature wisdom but the preaching of warners profits them not therefore o prophet turn away from them the day that the caller will call them to a terrible affair they will come forth their eyes humbled from their graves torpid like locusts scattered abroad hastening with eyes transfixed towards the caller hard is the stay the unbelievers will say before them the people of noah rejected their messenger they rejected our servant and said here is one possessed and he was driven out then he called on his lord i am one overcome do you then help me so we open the gates of heaven with water pouring forth and we cause the earth to gush forth with springs so the waters met and rose to the extent decreed but we bore him on an ark made of broad planks and caulked with palm fiber she floats under our eyes and care a recompense to one who had been rejected with scorn and we have left this as a sign for all time then is there any that will receive admonition but how terrible was my penalty and my warning and we have indeed made the quran easy to understand and remember then is there any that will receive admonition the aged people too rejected truth then how terrible was my penalty and my warning for we sent against them a furious wind on a day of violent disaster plucking out men as if they were roots of palm trees torn up from the ground yea how terrible was my penalty and my warning but we have indeed made the quran easy to understand and remember then is there any that will receive admonition the thamud also rejected their warners for they said what a man a solitary one from among ourselves shall we follow such a one truly should we then be straying in mind and mad is it that the message is sent to him of all people amongst us nay he is a liar an insolent one ah they will know on the morrow which is the liar the insolent one for we will send the she camel by way of trial for them so watch them o sali and possess yourself in patience and tell them that the water is to be divided between them each one's right to drink being brought forward by suitable turns but they called to their companion and he took a sword in hand and hamstrung her ah how terrible was my penalty and my warning for we sent against them a single mighty blast and they became like the dry stubble used by one who pens cattle and we have indeed made the quran easy to understand and remember then is there any that will receive admonition the people of lut rejected his warning we sent against them a violent tornado with showers of stones which destroyed them except lut's household them we delivered by early dawn as a grace from us thus do we reward those who give thanks and lut did warn them of our punishment but they disputed about the warning and they even sought to snatch away his guests from him but we blinded their eyes they heard now taste you my wrath and my warning early on the morrow an abiding punishment sees them so taste you my wrath and my warning and we have indeed made the quran easy to understand and remember then is there any that will receive admonition to the people of pharaoh two or four time came warnings from allah the people rejected all our signs but we seized them with such penalty as comes from one exalted in power able to carry out his will 
Are you unbelievers, O Quraysh, better than they? Or have you an immunity in the sacred books? Or do they say, we, acting together, can defend ourselves? Soon will their multitude be put to flight, and they will show their backs. Nay, the hour of judgment is the time promised them for their full recompense, and that hour will be most grievous and most bitter. Truly, those in sin are the ones straying in mind, and mad. The day they will be dragged through the fire on their faces, they will hear, taste you the touch of hell. Verily, all things have we created in proportion and measure. And our command is but a single act, like the twinkling of an eye. And oft in the past have we destroyed gangs like unto you. Then is there any that will receive admonition? All that they do is noted in their books of deeds. Every matter, small and great, is a record. As to the righteous, they will be in the midst of gardens and rivers. In an assembly to truth, in the presence of a sovereign omnipotent.